Modi has chaired a round table with 12 Indian AI startups qualified for the AI for All Global Impact Challenge at the India AI Impact Summit 2026. The startups are working in a diverse set of areas like healthcare, multilingual LLMs, material research, data analytics, engineering, simulations, among others. Startups highlight the rapid growth and vast future potential of the AI sector and observe that the center of gravity of AI innovation and deployment is beginning to shift towards India. Joining us on the broadcast is my colleague Brian Thomas with more on this. Brian, the Prime Minister has uh, chaired a round table with 12 Indian AI startups. Oh, well, yes, uh, 12 Indian AI startups that have qualified for the AI for All Global Impact Challenge under the upcoming India AI Impact Summit 2026 presented their ideas and innovations during this very round table, like you mentioned, chaired by the Prime Minister. These startups are working across a wide range of sectors. You, you talk about healthcare, Indian language uh, foundation models, multilingual uh, large uh, language models, speech to text to text to video technologies, energy, uh, in, uh, engineering simulations, material research, data analytics, and even generative AI applications for e commerce marketing and personalized content creation. The participating startup highlighted rapid growth and even immense uh, future potential of India's AI sector, not noting that the global sector of AI innovation and deployment is increasingly shifting towards India and also commented that the government's strong commitment to building a robust and enabling uh, artificial intelligence ecosystem positioning India prominently on the global AI map itself and even addressing the roundtable, the Prime Minister underscored the transformative role of AI in society and said that the upcoming India AI Impact Summit to be held next month would further strengthen India's leadership in the technology space and also said that the AI startups and entrepreneurs and co-architects of India's future, rather are uh, co-architects of India's future, adding that the country has both the capacity uh, for cutting-edge uh, technologies and innovations for large-scale uh, implementation. Yes. Right. Thank you so much, Bran, for all those details on that front. We are turning our attention now towards some other news that's coming in on the continuous